Marshall DSL 100 HR. This is what we are discussing in this episode. Let's get this up inside out. All the channels, equalization, reverb, effects loop, and the most discussed feature, the tone shift. My name is Marco Savoia and this is the Guitar and Coffee Show. If you're new here, consider subscribing to the channel. In this review we are checking all the voices of this amp, switching on and off the tone shift, checking the difference between tones and equalization. And all the amp setup will be right here. The Marshall DSL 100 has two channels, Classic Gain and Ultra Gain. In the classic gain, you have two voices, clean and crunch. And the ultra gain, you have overdrive one and overdrive two. The EQ is pretty much simple, bass, middle and treble, and also resonance and presence. And you can have the tone shift to cut the mid frequencies. Independent reverbs for both channels and two different master volumes. The amp comes with this beautiful foot switch, changing the channels and switching on and off the effects loop. You can also buy separately a special foot switch to control all the channels. Let's now check the clean channel. The clean voice sounds very good, but now let's get my preferred voice in this amp, the crunch voice.
Moving to the Ultra Gang channel, we are getting much heavier. Let's check first the Overdrive one. Compressed, it was a great sound for the first overdrive. But let's check how heavier we can get by the overdrive 2. Reverb. Let's go from no reverb to a lot of reverb. Let's set the reverb in 0, 4, 7 and 10. Now let's plug some pedals directly in the input and then in the effects loop. There is no big difference, but the nicest thing about the effects loop is you can switch on and off by the foot switch.
Now let's put the amp in the best situation, in a jam. guys it's undeniable this is a great amp the best part is affordable with that great tone of Marshall the bad part is there is a big jump in volume between the voices inside the same channel for example if you're jumping from clean to crunch or from overdrive 1 to overdrive 2 there is a jump in the volume this is the only part that kind of bothered me. If you like this video, smash the like button. For more videos like this, consider subscribing to the channel. But for now, that's all folks. Keep yourself rocking, safe, alive and kicking. See you 